Toby. Let's go crazy for Katie Kaki. Yes, go right. people that I was going to be doing stand-up comedy and they said, oh, Katie, as a female comedian, you know, you've just got to learn, you're going to have, you're going to get objectified. And I said to them, well, I've been overweight for quite some time and frankly, I need the confidence boost. <laughs> in the real world, I'm about a three. In the world of comics, I'm about a hard six. Um, and the guy before, he asked me if I'd be his friend and I said yes, but I'm from the Sunshine Coast, so fuck you. <laughs> Anyway, how's everyone's night been? Good? Good? Yes. I'm shitting myself. Um, but I have never been more pleased in my life to be upstaged by a fabulous mullet. I have never seen one the likes of those. That is amazing. Um, so people might ask why I'm, I'm up here doing stand-up comedy. I'm a mum of two kids um, and I don't exactly fit the stereotype. Um, but you know when you're in a certain mood or you've drunk in a certain amount and uh, you make a decision and then the mood passes but you're still stuck with the decision? Um, that's kind of what happened with the last couple of weeks ago. I've been, I've been talking about doing stand-up comedy for a while. And, uh, you know, we had friends over and we were drinking and everyone was getting all, you know, laughing and having fun. My endorphins were up and I was feeling really happy. You know, it was either them or the Valium. Either one of them. Um... And uh, I said to them, you know what, bugger it, you know, I'm going to do stand-up comedy. So that night, I signed up, and, and then I sobered up, and uh, anyway, that's why I'm here, so great night. Um, so I was talking to people about how uh, I'm doing my first stand-up comedy night, and they said, okay, you're going to get on stage, and you're just going to forget everything you were going to say. And I was like, it's just like your brain to do that, isn't it? Like... Your brain is the one thing that's supposed to be on your side. It's the one thing that's supposed to keep you alive. You know, you're going, don't forget, don't forget, don't forget, don't forget. And your brain goes, hey, I've got a great idea. Why don't you forget everything you were going to say? Or, you know, it's like you're in a jungle and you see a lion and you go, I should probably get away from that. And your brain goes, I think I could outrun them. Or, uh, you know, you're walking down the street and you see a guy and he's standing there with a sign and it's saying, free puppies by a panel van. And, uh, you know, your higher brain goes, mm, something doesn't seem right about that. And your brain goes, puppies! <laughs> and uh, three weeks later, you end up back home. Um, or, uh, you know, it's like you're at Bill Cosby's house. And uh, he goes, hey. <laughs> because I imagine that's what Bill Cosby does. I mean, hey, do you want a drink? And you go, no. But your brain goes, well, I am quite parched. Uh, so that was a fun night. Uh, I don't really want to talk about that one. Um, yeah, as I said, it's my first time. Uh, and I actually mean it's my first time. Not like when you lie about it in your first time. Hey, honey. <laughs> uh, um, no, um, <laughs> And uh, I was saying, uh, you know, what you should do is you should research some fellow comedians, you know. Um, so I started watching uh, Amy Schumer, because I thought she'd be pretty funny. I've seen her movies. Um, <laughs> hmm, how do I say this? Um, you've all had a few drinks by this point, so um, have you ever, sort of just in quiet time, thought to yourself, I wonder what kind of small barnyard animal her vagina smells like. <laughs> no? No? Well, me neither. But now, after watching her comedy special, I feel I, lo I know her vagina more intricately than I know my own. And, uh, and then I thought, okay, well, maybe it's just female comedians. Maybe, maybe uh, you know, I'm a bit of a tomboy. Uh, clearly, you can see by the dress and the boots. Um, and um, so I decided I'd watch Jim Jeffries. You know, um, I thought I said, oh, Jim, Jim Jeffries is hilarious. Penis. Penises are funny. Um, so I was like, oh, okay, well, let's watch Jim Jeffries. And, you know, I've been, uh, I've been with my partner for 14 years now. Yes. Um, thank you, thank you. Uh, he's not my partner. <laughs> and um, <laughs> I don't want to, you notice my partner's quiet. He's just going, oh, fuck. It's been that long. Um, 
anyway, in the, you know, I, I've been with my partner for 14 years. I don't want to see a penis in real life, let alone listen to a guy talk about his for an hour. Here's my impression of Jim Jeffries. Hey. What's smaller than a Tic Tac and less minty? My penis. Um, anyway, um, as I said, it's my first time, and um, I have—I know you're musically me, but I thought this was funny. <laughs> Gonna say it. Um, <laughs> anyway, as I said, after my actual first time, if it had to be my first time, I'm glad it was with all of you guys. Thank <laughs> you.